Okay, all of them have found their way into the yard now. There's about seven of them. And I'm going to have to call uh, someone, I think. I don't know if I can do this random off my own, but there's some more down there. You can see them down near the pool. They're going for a little bit of a hoon around. And hopefully they might end up... Hopefully they might all end up together, but there they are. And I, fortunately, I can't find the mother around. These ones ran in underneath from the uh, gate. And I can't find a mother. So, yeah, not sure what's going on. But they're definitely calling to each other and I think they'll all end up rounded up together. So I just don't know how to round them up. But there's the other ones over there. And yep, uh, they've done exactly what I thought they might do. But they'll be okay. They'll be okay to run on that. There you go. There's all six of them. Ah, they've all found each other. There you go. They've all met up in the middle and they're trying to have a swim but they can't quite work it out. That's the funny thing about pool covers. They're very cute and very adorable and I don't know what to do. So hopefully if we let them stay there for now and I'll give them a call and uh, find out what I can do. That's so funny trying to watch them swim and they can't. That is really funny. Well, here we are. It's, what, the 6th of October, Monday, the 6th of October, 08. We've managed to rescue six of the little ducklings. Unfortunately, one of them ran across the road. He didn't actually get splattered or anything. He just ran into a different house and got away, and we just could not find him. So, there's six of the seven, and they're all okay, and we're about to take them down to Judy, who's the animal welfare uh, person in Byron Bay.